All right, hey everyone, uh, this is James Brandon, and if you were watching this, hopefully you've purchased my ebook, Tax Sharp, and I thank you for that. So, what I want to do here is just show you all uh, how to move that ebook into your iPad or your iPhone or, or whatever device. Uh, I get a lot of questions about this. People are asking if they need to go to the App Store to purchase it or anything like that. No, it's just a PDF that you would download to your computer. You can read it there, or you can use um, the the um, iBooks app on your i uh, phone or iPad to read it, and it looks great on either device. So, uh, if we pull up iTunes here, you'll see um, a book section on the left hand side in your library, and this is where all of your books are kept um, that you would want to read through uh, an iDevice. And if I bring up my uh, Finder window here, go over to my desktop. And we should find Tax Sharp in here, right here. So it's really easy. All you have to do is go from your desktop. So just click and drag. And I'll bring that over to Books. And it'll just drop in, like so. So now it's in iTunes. So if I want to put it on my iPhone or my iPad, I would just plug either one of those in. Um, and actually, now that now that there's iCloud, it should actually just sync up automatically if you have um, auto sync set up. Um, for mine, I like to kind of pick and choose what goes on my iPhone, so I don't have auto sync set up for that because um, I, I don't want all of my music on there. So I just pick and choose, and same with books. So from here, you would just go down to your um, devices that are plugged in and go over to um, the phone and then click books sync books and turn that on and then you from here you can either do all books or selected books and then i would simply click that and then hit um, hit apply from there and it's that easy um, after that's done you can unplug your device uh, pull up your ibooks app and then you'll click um, downloadable pdfs i think is the category um, the first category will usually be books, and then after that, you can. You, there should be a category for PDFs. Um, so you just click that, and then uh, you can start reading from there. Thanks for watching, and let me know if you have any other questions.